Hi Gemini, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot and I'm here to do your reading for June. This is for Gemini, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Happy birthday! So, let's see what we got for Gemini for the month of June. I'm going to get one of these and we're going to use that deck right there. What do we have for the month of June for Gemini? What does Gemini need to know? What's coming up? Now keep in mind that this is, uh, the timing is fluid. So if it doesn't resonate the day that you watch it, watch it later. <laughs> and then again, it may not resonate at all with you. But Gemini, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Angel of Love. Looks like somebody is bringing you love, Gemini. Alright. So, I mean, somebody from above is an angel, okay? So somebody may see you as an angel as well. I mean, it could certainly go that way. So, this is this is love. So, love is at the forefront, put it that way. Absolutely. Um, let me just see if I can get a little bit more light over here. All right. So, we got some love here. King of Swords reversed. So, you know. Some of you may be feeling a little cold-hearted. You may be a little withdrawn. Maybe you've given up on love. Maybe you've given up on communication. Maybe you're feeling a little cold at this time. Maybe even resentful. Or you could be dealing with a person that is uh, cold and resentful and mean. Okay? So you could be dealing with this person or you could be feeling that way. I mean, you we all go through stages like this where... We don't know what to do next. I mean, maybe you don't know what to do next. Maybe you've reached a point where you don't want to play any more games with anybody. You know? That could certainly be the case. Let me turn this one off. Seems awfully dark in here. Anyway. And maybe it's dark, period. It's funny. It does seem... I mean, I got my usual lights on. Emperor reverse. Things may be a little... Yeah, somebody may be angry. Somebody may be angry. Or they could have been dealing with an individual who was very controlling and cold and unemotional. Okay? So you could be dealing with this individual. You may feeling like you may be feeling like you don't you don't want to give your power away. You may feel like your things are a little chaotic. There could be some anger here. You may be angry. Or you could be dealing with an angry person. I don't know. Two of Wands reversed. A Knight of Wands reversed. So somebody's not really wanting to take action, or they're not taking action. Um, stuck staying in a safe spot it's like i'm going to protect myself at this time you know you're probably that's where you're at you're, you're probably in protection mode you're probably not wanting to get yourself involved in anything um that's going to burn you i think that you've been burned by somebody and you're probably in protection mode yeah, you, you're probably not accepting love or seeing love or even wanting to concentrate on love. I mean, you're probably in a little, a little bit of a state of, of bitterness, perhaps, you know, uh, discontent for sure. Eight of Pentacles, this is working hard. Maybe you're just focusing on your work, you're focusing on your money, you're focusing on everything but love. But <laughs> this angel is here to bring you love. Maybe they're here to open your heart again. Maybe something has happened that has closed you off emotionally and... Up, the angels are wanting to help. Let's just see what we got here. Ooh, Four of Wands reverse is going to be an upcoming celebration. It's unexpected good fortune is coming into your life. So there's a new relationship, I think, for some of you. Or you may be in a relationship that it's about to be more committed. You may not even see it coming. You could, you could, a commitment could be coming and you don't even see it. Now, the, this is the Knight of Pentacles reversed. This is, I think that you've put love to a complete halt. You've put, you know, moving forward into a relationship to a complete halt. I think that something has been delayed. Something has been stalled. Maybe you don't want to mess up your routine right now. Maybe you're, you're, you're just focusing on your job and you're like, I'm trying to get my life back on track. That last one really messed me up. I don't even want to have anything to do with it for some of you. 
Um, but we have the Ace of Cups. So yes, there's love coming whether you like it or not. There's love here. Overflowing. Okay. So you guys are have getting some sort of... Uh, Well, we have a, a potential uh, love here, a potential new love or a potential reconciliation, whatever it is. Somebody um, wants to love you or they want to give you emotional support or they are loving on you. Somebody's loving on you, Gemini. Somebody on the outside, this is on, in the external uh, position, somebody on the outside is really, really loving you. You may be fearful of getting in another commitment. This is your fears, your hopes and fears. You're fearful. You're fearful of this because you've been burned. Somebody didn't follow through. Right now, you're focusing on your work. You're focusing on your money. You're focusing on everything but love. And this angel says, oh, but love is so important. Endings bring new beginnings. This is the death card. No, this is the moon card. Why did I? I must have just missed that five. <laughs> but take what I said, okay? Endings bring new beginnings. Something has ended here. It's obvious. It's obvious that there's been something painful that has happened that has caused you to close yourself off. It has caused you to not even want to consider this. But now something has been hidden. There's something going on behind the scenes, something below the surface that is about to be shown to you. Might have to do with the full moon. The full moon, okay? Might have to do with a new moon. Has to do with a moon, okay? Now I don't know when the moons are, the new moon or the full moon is, but. I think that there's something is going to be revealed around one of the moon phases, whether it's the new moon or the full moon. Okay? Something that you don't see coming. You don't even see it. It's it's hidden right now, but it's coming. It is coming. And it's 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 going to it's whatever this is, it's gonna it's gonna it's gonna it's gonna fill your heart. It's gonna pour right into your heart and you probably aren't going to be able to deny it, okay? Um this is your pain, the three of swords, suffering, pain, heartache, grieving. This is going to help you to heal from a situation. You're, you know, this is, I know that you've been stabbed, you've been hurt really, really badly, but I think that whoever this person is, is going to help you to you know, stop focusing on that pain. The Five of Cups reversed. This this is the Knight of Swords reversed. This person isn't going to rush you. This person isn't going to push you. This person, whoever this person is that is coming in is, isn't going to be in a rush. Okay, they're definitely not going to be in a rush. They're going to want to take their time. They're going to see that you're grieving. They're, they know that you're hurting. They're going to take their time with you. They're going to try to help you to heal from this painful situation, whatever it is. Could be a Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. Could be an Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. It could be a Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Could be a could be anybody. Could be Libra, Gemini. Could be anybody. We have all the signs here. You know this right? This is Aries. This is Aries. This is um, somebody's been trying to control their feelings, control their emotions, and. I think that this love is going to be so big that you're probably not going to be able to control it. You're going to not be able to, you know, push it away. Three of Cups. There's definitely going to be some sort of reunion or celebration coming up. Three of Cups with the Four of Wands. Okay, you mean, if you don't know who this person is, you may you may see, meet them during some sort of picnic, some sort of party, some sort of reunion, some sort of celebration where there's a lot of people. You could even meet this person. I mean, this is social. This is a social gathering, or it could be social media. But I really feel like this is in person. I feel like this, I don't know why, I feel like this is in person. 
Three, this is the Empress reversed. You're going to be dealing with some pain, unfortunately. There's pain here. And it hasn't been dealt with yet. It hasn't been delivered yet. It hasn't, it's like somebody is, um, definitely going to be sh is shutting down their emotions you could be dealing if you were the male you could be dealing with this person this is a taurus or a libra you could be dealing with a woman who is not emotionally available she, maybe she's dealing with some pain of her own maybe she has problems with her children or problems with her family or something like that this woman is not in the state of mind where she's able to love at this point i mean she's maybe she's got some bitterness inside of her she's hurting she's hurting still she's she's going through some pain and maybe she needs a friend. Maybe you start out as friends with this woman because she's dealing with some pain. She's feeling cold. So there's a woman here that is feeling cold and she's definitely discontent because of some sort of situation that she has dealt with. But I feel like the male, whoever the male is, they've dealt, this male has dealt with some pain too. But something that has been hidden is going to be revealed And it's like you're not, you probably won't be able to restrain yourself. You won't be able. It's probably going to make you feel weak, okay? It is going to make you feel weak, whatever this is. This person's like this person's going to put in effort to help you, to heal. They're going to see that you're struggling. They are. They're going to see that you're struggling. And they don't. Maybe they don't want you to make the wrong choice. I don't know. This is options. You are going to have multiple options. Choose wisely. Choose wisely this month. You're going to have to make a decision. And make sure you do choose wisely because what you own owns you. You know, give deep thought. And I think that you probably will be stressed. I think that you're going to be stressed because you're going to get this overload of love from somebody and you may not be like I don't you may be like I don't want it I don't want it you may there's bitterness here okay there is you may be like I don't want it I'm not interested I'm just not interested in love right now I'm suffering I'm in pain I'm not healed whatever I'm not good I'm not in the mood you might be like that you know and but and and you're struggling I feel like we have somebody here that is really struggling whether it's you or the other person okay because this could go vice versa somebody is here is really struggling to open up their heart And I feel like a lot of uh, some tender, loving care is going to go a long way because I think now somebody is going to is going to really, really think about, really, really think about, open-mindedly even about this new passionate opportunity, this new option. Okay, I think there's a passionate new opportunity here. I think that there is um, going to be a strong, strong, strong attraction. Whoever this person is, they, they are very, very, very attracted to you. And or, or if you are the male watching this, the woman that is going to be coming into your life, you're, you're very attracted to her. Okay? There's, there's going to be a strong attraction here. This, this person is very, very um, passionate. And there's a, lot, there's a high uh, s magnetic pull towards this person. Um, and... Take all the time you need to think about it. I see that you're really going to think about it because there's there's so much. I mean, there's going to be, a, I think that you're really going to be tempted to to go with this, even though you, you know, it wasn't what you had in mind. It really isn't what you had in mind. Um, be careful. Be careful. Somebody may be wanting to come back. Okay, I got to be honest with you. Somebody that has hurt you in the past may be wanting to come back. Somebody that didn't know your value. Somebody that didn't trust. Somebody that didn't respect you. Somebody that didn't that you don't trust. Somebody that you didn't trust. Somebody that you know that brought you down may want to come back. So 
be really, really careful. This could this is somebody that may have lied to you and, and kept you in a state of confusion. Maybe this person is some sort of illusionist and you know, they involved another person and now they want to come back. Who knows? That could be the case for some of you. Be careful. Be careful because you know, you may want to refrain and restrain yourself from this person because they really stabbed you, they really hurt you in the past. For some of you, you gotta be careful, you gotta choose wisely. Okay? Take all the time you need to think about this. I mean, follow your gut. Follow your gut. Give deep thought. You may be dealing with somebody who doesn't have good intentions. Somebody that really, really withdrew from you and hurt you in the past. Maybe they want to come back for another stab. Okay? All right? It's like they stabbed you once and they're going to stab you again. Okay? So um, just be careful, okay? Be really careful. Um The devil. Wow. You could be dealing with a Capricorn. There's the, We have Pisces here, too. Pisces, Cancer. We have Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Well, we have everybody. We already talked about this. But it's like there's, a, there's you know, you're going to be given an opportunity for love. I think you're probably going to be given more than one. Okay? You have options. Multiple options here. And I think you probably didn't want any of them. And now they've got all these options here looking at you. And you're like, oh, my God. Now, this is something that has been hidden again. Something isn't as it seems. With the moon card and the devil card, they're both ruled by the shadow. So something isn't as it seems. You're going to have to look below the surface. This, you know, Don't get yourself into an unhealthy situation because... I don't know why. Because you're addicted to it. Because you're obsessed with it. Because it, felt, it feels good for a minute. Okay? This is instant gratification that doesn't last to anything long term. So be really, really, really careful. You could have somebody here that uh, is toxic to your energy and, you know, they want to come back for that next, you know, stab, whatever. Um, be really, 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 really careful. This person could have another woman. They could have another person, but they don't want to let go of the control. They don't want to give their, you know, they want to keep that power over you. Just be careful. There could be another woman if, if you're dealing with a, a man, you know. Um, if you are the male, too, you could you could be dealing with a woman that has another man. I mean, you got to be really, really careful here. Somebody's not being honest, put it that way. But you have multiple options, so you're going to have to look below the surface, take all the time you need. There is love being offered to you. And you're two, at least two people. I know that there is. This reminds me of you. This is the twins. This is the twins. And maybe this is a, I hate to say it. I did, the words just came out of my mouth. So this is, this is two of pentacles is, it's time to take that next step. It's time for a change. It's time for a change. It's time for you to be, you know, adapt to new situations and try to be flexible. Try to be flexible here. I think that, you know, this is an obsession. This is holding on. I think that you have somebody here that is, 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 and maybe some of you are obsessed with this. Okay, I'm not I, 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 obsessed with something that needs to let go. Maybe you're obsessed with an illusion. This is an illusion. This is a fantasy and this is a fantasy. Some of you are obsessed with a fantasy that is toxic. Okay? Or the other person is. Be careful. Be careful. Give deep thought to this relationship before you get yourself involved with a toxic individual. You have other options. Anyway, you're going to receive an offer of love this month. From somebody that I think is obsessed with you. And I mean the Ten of Pentacles reversed. This is turning away from it. This is turning away from it because it's not stable. It's not secure. Six of Swords reluctant to move in that direction. It's There's no peace going to come out of it. You know. This person, you know, isn't going to bring peace to your life if it is this person that stabbed you before. Six of Wands. Now, you got to think about these sixes reversed. Sixes reversed is it's time to get your life back on track. Reevaluate. You really are going to need to reevaluate this situation. And, and the devil is kind of like a 666 card, right? It's like this person is is coming to take back their power. It's almost like maybe it's a narcissist. I hate to say the word, but 
be careful, okay? This person will steal the healing that you have done. It will bring you right back to square one. I don't know where this is coming from, but this is a message you need to hear. Um, there's no, no progress will be made. There's no victory and success will come out of this. It will not bring peace and harmony to your life. Be really careful. You're going to have to make a choice. I think that you're at this point where <coughs> you don't want anybody, but you've been burned. You've been burned. You're, you're, you're starting to heal. You're starting to do good. You know, and, the, and now, now like this up above, these angels are bringing you love. They're bringing you options for love. You're going to have at least two options for love. That's what I see. One of these people does not have good intentions. One of these people just wants to take back their power. It's like that narcissist approach, okay? I'm sorry, I don't like to say it, but it's the truth. But then again, you have this other option. So you have two options. You want, But this, this person that's going to come in, trust me, the one that they're going to shower you with love and attention, this, this narcissist, okay? They are. They are. Be careful. Be really careful. Okay, you don't want to go back to that. You really don't. This person does not have good intentions. I feel like you have a better option if you could really look past it. You do. With the Five of Cups reversed, you have a better option. Don't let somebody burn you again. This is a test. This is, the te this is a test for you. Holding on to a death. There's that death card I was talking about. It is reversed. This is somebody that is obsessed with holding on to a dead end. Ho holding on. They don't want to let you go. Okay, now, you know, they don't want, they don't want this, they don't want this change. It is a time of change. It's time for your new life. Don't look back. You, you take the high road. It's time to start over. It's time to do new things. It's time to try new things. Go, go the path less traveled. The one worth waiting for will come when the time is right. You've done a lot of healing. This is the temperance card. Don't go back to some old addiction. So, uh, Gemini, I feel like you're going to receive an outpouring of love. And I think that mainly from this person that doesn't have good intentions. But you're, you have options. I think that you're going to receive, you know, you have an opportunity with somebody else as well. This somebody else may be in the future. And you have, a, you have to pass this test. You have to pass this test. It's a test of your self-worth and your self-value. Because we got somebody here that don't know their self-worth and self-value. And the Knight of Pentacles is a test. You are being, your self-worth and your self-value is being tested. Choose the better option. Look below, look, don't look below the surface. Look, look, there's something hidden here. You got somebody here that is not with the devil and the moon. They got bad intentions, put it that way. They just want their control. They want their power. And you do have a better option. I just cut the deck. Somebody else. Now, this is a lover's card. The lover's card tells me you do have two options. You do. This this other one is not the one that you thought it was. It's somebody different. and somebody that doesn't fit the description. It's nothing like the last one. You have somebody else that you are meant to be with. Please do not look back. You are going to have two options both of them are going to be very attractive. This is a test. Choose the high road. Good luck.